G'day, that's Slot Car Guy here, and welcome back to the delivery unboxing. And today, I got a surprise delivery from Slot Track Scenics. And yes, I was surprised because I did not know I was receiving a package from them. So thank you guys for surprising me, and of course, for your continued support in 2022 on my channel. And I've also got a Carrera digital slot car to show you guys today that I purchased from Metro Hobbies here in Melbourne, Australia. But let's have a look at what Slot Track Scenics sent me. And yes, I was surprised, but I'm also uh, wrapped because this item is very very cool now for you playing at home if you are going to search the website it is tw10 for the product code and it is 10 rubber tire walls how cool is that now of course i run an instagram page this is going to help my photographs because i do like taking photographs of scenery and of course i can put these around my track and yes tw10 for the product code on their website and i'll quickly show the website here on the back and there it is 10 of these puppies cannot wait but they've also sent me two alternative ways to affix these to your track. Now let's talk plastic track first, and I'll go with the product code CFP, CFP10, and there's 10 clips for plastic track. I'll quickly show that off. And as all good companies do, they've sent me some instructions, and I'll quickly show you the back on how you can affix these to your plastic track at home. And of course, it's not just for the tire walls. You can also buy other products to run some of their barriers. Really cool. I think that's really, really, really well thought out. But if you do have a wooden track, you're probably thinking, Trav, what about my wooden track? Well, never fear. CFW10 will help you. And this is the wooden track plug. Now, you get 10 of these as well, I believe. 10, yep, wooden pl plug tracks. Go again. <laughs> So what you do with these is you drill a five millimeter hole, six mil deep, and of course these plug in and you can place the item on top. So really, really cool. But what is this slot car I purchased from Metro Hobbies? But before we get into that, thank you Slot Track Scenics. That is really, really cool. And I did get surprised because I did not know I was receiving anything. But let's check out this digital slot car. And when I say car, truck, this thing I could not pass up on, and it is the Carrera Race Truck Truck Start Convention Nova Racing Number Six. Take a look at this beast. Now that thing is wicked, and of course I'm going to do a full unboxing, a teardown, and a hot lap. But I think this thing is absolutely incredible. There is another version which I'll put a picture up. I probably will get the second version because I do like trucks, but I'm really, really happy that Carrera have made some new trucks. And yes, this is digital, so I can run it on my digi track and my analog track. So there you have it. Some tire walls from Slot Track Scenic. Thank you very much, guys, with instructions and, of course, some plugs that I can use on my track, whether it's plastic or wood. So I do appreciate that. So please support uh, Slot Track Scenics. And, of course, if you ha are here in Melbourne, Australia, please support Metro Hobbies because they are local hobby shop but as always at that slot car guy on youtube and instagram i will be doing a review of these very soon you will see these in photographs very very soon but i will always be safe take care support your local ciao so i thought i'd quickly show how i'm going to utilize these clips and these tire walls on my carrera track and of course how i'm going to take my photos and to show you how versatile these tires are and as you can see they sit perfectly normal on their own just on a bit of track and of course this is harrell rs wooden track and here are the clips and i'll quickly show you what the clips look like because if you are running scalar trip which i'm not uh you do have different cutouts here uh for different style of tracks i believe now of course i'm only testing it on carrera so i will show you now how i use these on my carrera track but of course i said these are versatile the tires can stand on their own with no problems you can just slip these in and use these as stands if you want to as you can see they're pretty sturdy but if you do want to put these on your track i have set up some carrera track which i'll show you now and this is how i will be running it on my track now take a look at these clips i've simply clipped these into my bit of carrera track and i'll quickly show you exactly how i've done that now as you can see these will move freely until you position them where you want them and i've simply used the front cutout which is this one here I first attach that to the track, which literally it sits underneath the track like so. Then you place the tire on that little mound, which will hold it exactly on the outside of your track. Now, of course, if you've got borders on your Carrera track, it will also work on your borders. But I think this is a really, really cool item. And just with using these little bit of clips on the outside, you can run some fences or barriers if you want and make it a full product. Really cool. So again, thank you, Slot Track Scenics. Now, of course, I can't test this on 
uh, Scalatric or other brand track. This is a Carrera test only and standing solo. So if you do and have used these on uh, Scalatric, SCX, Ninko, or any other track, please hit my comments and give the viewers some advice on how best to use these clips. All right, take care, be safe, ciao. Know that they ride or die. I keep boys by my side. Know that they ride or die. I keep boys by my side. Oh, boy. Day we hustle, but the night.